Hey guys, I'm Steph with Hair and Makeup by Steph. Thanks so much for watching. Today I'm gonna to be doing a tutorial on how to do a thick braid um, that's sort of intricate and fun for summer. So let's get started. I want her hair to have a lot of volume in it, um, but I don't want it to be super curly. So I'm just gonna loosely curl everything in opposite directions using the GHD Soft Curl Iron. This curling iron is one and a quarter inches, so it's the perfect size for creating that wavy look that's not too curly and not too straight. Doing this kind of prep before you do a braid like this is really important. How it's curled can really make or break the whole look and this curling iron is definitely my go-to for the perfect amount of wave. So what I'm gonna do now to start my braid is I'm gonna section out the hair from the ears and up and clip that aside for later. Okay, now what I'm gonna do with the back section is create a loose elastic braid going down the side. So to begin that, I'm gonna take a small section of hair by her right ear and a small section of hair by her left ear. I'm gonna bring them both over to the side, secure them with an elastic, flip that elastic inside out, and then I'm gonna pull on these sections to make it nice and loose and soft. I'm gonna continue that process working all the way down the side. So at about this point, I'm just gonna start back combing through the ends to add a little bit more volume. And then I'm gonna take a small section of her hair and I'm gonna loop it up and stick it through the elastic. So I have the two sides sectioned out for later. Now I'm gonna take the crown section and start a regular French fishtail braid. Okay, once I pancake the braid, I'm gonna bring it over to the side and then I'm gonna weave in and out of the base that I created below to connect the two braids together. So I'm gonna start at the top, make a hole with my fingers, weave through, and then go back up. and then back through underneath one more time just to hide that elastic. Now I'm gonna let down both sides and just do a loose three strand braid down each side and they're gonna meet together in the back. Okay, once you have both sides braided, you're gonna combine them and do one braid together. Okay, once your braid is nice and loose, you're just gonna wrap it up to the roots and bobby pin it in place, creating a little bit of bulk right there. All right, and that is how I would do an intricate braid that goes off to the side. Thanks so much for watching, guys.